because she climbed yeah. is also a bit rough. But anyways, getting Compared. into the yeah. main show here. Uh, I'm not sure if they're going to do a button warm-up, but we got Ashimo versus Nizumamo, both extremely good players in their own right. And, uh, okay, well, okay. I can tell it's... immediately off the fireball it's in a warm-up, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Going straight into it. And uh, Nizumamo, of course, he's been doing really good at, like, sumo battles and things, I feel like, is where I see him shine and, like, my sumo tops. Yeah. And uh, he's traveling all the way to Kairi Kulon. Uh, trying to cement his name onto here, and I could very well see him oh. make a top bait if he goes onto a great run. And uh, big combo starting here from Nizumamo, but Ashima going oh, to the focus attack, and wow! I hit that. that. <laughs> yeah, like, I thought that he got like the aerial hit or something. But... Yeah, I thought so too, and I, I like how Ashima actually still opts for the focus attack here. I think he SDIs the first hit mm -hmm. and then just does the focus attack or something because. Usually, you can see the Bayna sometimes only get the first hit of those uppies, and yeah. if you do, uh, you might as well focus attack that and get a punish. And already at 124% here on Nizamamo, he could very well die to any confirm now from Ashima or a back air. But now off the stage here, tries to go for a back air, but gonna be able to air dodge back it on the stage. A nice little combo from Nizamamo, a little bit of a reversal. Oh. Yeah, apparently, you can like angle that up smash down. Oh, really? Yeah, it hits like ledge. Well, damn, I, didn't I don't even know, know that. that. Supposed to be like a good two frame option. Ooh. Oh, but really good back air. Yeah, calling out that ABK there with the back air and trying to call out that jump, but Ashimo holding steady in that shield. Get a nice little down smash combo off onto Nizumabo here, and now he's gonna have to try and make up this deficit. But oh, I didn't know you could actually just crouch under all of that too. Do you they think you can like too. grounded side B against the fireballs? Yeah, that's a good question. I don't know, because it those like fireballs really don't have a lot of priority, but oh, gonna be able to focus that straight through that back air that definitely would have killed if it hit. But holding on to his stock for his dear life right now. And Ashimo looking pretty clean. Tries to call out that oh. ABK with the back air, but unfortunately didn't get the spacing just right there, too. Oh, uh -oh. is that it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> too much rage. Yeah, that was a very nice confirming. Ryu with rage is one of the scariest things in this game, but outspacing that jab with a back air. Nizumamo going to be able to get rid of Ashimo's first stock of the game here. Yeah, that's probably like the hard part of the a, a matchup. Like, if you can't. Kill Ooh. as Bayo, and then if that happens, like Ryu abuses rage a lot. Yeah, I mean Bayonetta definitely has like early kills that she can get, but notably does struggle to kill if she doesn't get those crazy combos off. And uh, Ashimo definitely knows how to hold on to a stock extremely well, especially with focus stack there and things like that. But oh, oh. charging this up, and oh no, oh, she hit it. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, he actually just knew she'll get him straight into that F smash, and this is actually immediately even. Mm -hmm. That's actually <laughs> crazy. Damn. And oh, gonna get a big combo off, but this is the down tilt. Gonna be able to air dodge straight away there. But oh no, in the whirlwind oh. now. I Ashimo think he's opt opting for like an SDI down. Oh yeah, I think so. Oh, can he get out of this one? Yeah. Nah, I mean, he's not gonna no, but die like, just yet. Yeah, he's not gonna kill get killed off of it though. Yeah. Oh, that back air, unfortunately, the weak hitbox of that one. Ashima getting back on the stage at 128%. He's got a lot of rage, but Nizumamo not really at kill percent just yet. Is he? Oh, uh, no, sure? down air? Okay, never mind. <laughs> That's within, yeah. gonna be able to save him out there. This, going this for is running fair. Though, right? Yeah, like, I mean, if he gets a jab into like an yeah. up, air, uh, up air or something, definitely could hit. Oh, 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 oh my god, the air dodge almost gets oh, snuffed out, but oh, oh, oh my god, he misses. Oh, oh, oh what? That oh, kills. that kills. Oh, oh, oh damn. He's, he really just scratched his head over that one. That sucks. Yeah. He, yeah. If he just hit the smash stack in the right direction. Yeah, if he just hit that down kill. smash. But crossing him up, and Ashimo gonna take the early lead here. 1-0 on Nizumama, and I think everything is best of five at this point. Yeah, the Shoryuken has, like, really low and, and lag, especially if you, like, use, like, the the command version, right? I think. Yeah, I think so. Like, it's just, like, deceptively yeah. not that much end lag. But now, onto Nizumama's stage pick here. See what he tries to go for. Also, I feel like like Ashima's recoveries are like insanely good. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like people are always like, yeah, show the recovery, like, you know, Loki, Edge Carnival. But also, like the Tatsu <laughs> priority on Ryu is kind of insane. Like I've tried to edge guard Ashima uh, not Ashima, yeah. of course, I don't play against <laughs> caliber of him. But like the side B Tatsus, and then I'll just get hit. So I think it's just really hard for Nizumamo to like try and get those like upbeat edge guards on characters that Bayonetta can normally edge guard. But going on to PS2 right now, this is my one getting a quick little down tilt. Doesn't really lead it to oh, anything else, DI, but, but ooh, actually getting that uh, tech, but Ashimo with a good SDI. We'll be able to skip that combo. Quick 29 on each of them. Oh. Oh. He's down tilt soft button. He's memo. Get back onto the stage here. Ashimo playing under the platform. 
Oh, what a conversion. Oh, nice. Going to be able to get this Tatsu combo off now. And Nizumamo at 81%. Tries to go for this F smash. Trying to call out an aggressive option from him. But Nizumamo not giving it to him. And off the top, this I don't think that kill him. Chill. Oh, oh, actually able to focus that, that last hit, too. That was pretty smart. Oh, what's the grab? Oh, nice. APK. Oh, my God. Yeah, actually he, go for he's, like, always SCI'ing down. Yeah. Because, like, I, I think a lot of people opt for, like, SCI up to, like, take less percents, uh -huh. but for like Ashmo, like he doesn't mind the percents, it'll build him rage, That's letting true, yeah. him like Ooh. get kills earlier like that, but like as long as he doesn't die early is like, he's, he's like fine. Yeah, that's definitely true, like as long as you just don't die off like the top, like mm -hmm. boom, like Ryu, especially the way Ashmo's placed, he can like preserve a stock like really long, and if he gets like one jab on you bro, Oh, it's over. But getting that back off, and Ashima at 186 here at all. Oh. Is that going to be doing it? Oh, oh, goes deep for the edge guard. Can he make it back? <laughs> yep, of course he can, bro. Bayonetta recovery. Let's go. And oh my god, immediately aggressive with the ABK. Immediately. Uh, when Ashima, oh, oh, what? Oh, what? Wait, wait, he alive, right? Oh, no. no. Oh, damn. damn. The reversal. <laughs> okay, I, that's got to hurt. Yeah, that was, that was insane. Damn, bro. <laughs> Damn, bro, that sucks. But Nizumama, uh, not deterred all the way just yet. Still 38% to work with on this uh, game number two. Yeah, it is a best of five, too. True. Oh, nice pass within. Let me get out of that sticky situation here. And Ashima Loki can kill off the top leg better than Bayonetta, bro. Okay, For sure, right. you can compose those up air chains. are like absolutely insane. But Nizumama's turn here. Gets those four airs off. But again, gonna be able to focus attack the last hit. Doesn't really move anywhere. Oh, nice. But these background and shields for these ABKs are actually like kind of insane. That's like a lot of like damage for whiffing that in. Oh, oh yeah, that high jab into the shore you can that was a clean game number two right there. Damn. It's literally just a difference in like kill power, I feel <laughs> <laughs> That's true, yeah. Like as soon as Ashima touches him, it's like yeah. it just looks over. I wonder if I, uh, I wonder what stage pick Nizumama going for. You think he's just running back on PS2? I mean, it was like a really unfortunate downer there on that game too, though. Like low key. Like if he didn't get that, I mean, who knows, you know? Cause like, oh, okay, yeah, he is uh, opted for a different stage pick here. I'm liking the ideas. Like you can definitely edge guard a lot better on a matchup like this, yeah. and a lot less space for like Ashima to like dash back, cause he does love just like those dash back whip punish play styles. And uh, in the corner here, nice, gonna be off to just jump away. Dealing with that pressure pretty nicely here, but Ashima still with a 50% yeah. lead right now. Immediately onto this game number three. This could be uh, potentially last uh, last game for Nizamama into the winner's side of this Kagari Bikulon. Yeah. Uh, wait, this is kill percent, right? Or does he not have enough rage? <laughs> I don't think he has enough rage to kill just yet. But oh, okay, never oh, mind. That's, yeah, that's definitely yeah. <laughs> yeah, if you get hit that focus attack, it's definitely going to be able to kill an Ashima sitting clean at a 7%, healthy as hell, and. Uh, Wow, oh. first game of the day, and he's looking marvelous. Oh. All right. Nice, gonna be able to get this up B off here. Get these forward airs, 76% onto Ashima right now on the ledge. Let's see what Nizumama does on this ledge trap scenario, but, oh, Ashima actually going for aggressive option with that up air. Gonna be able to get off here. Nice, off for the fireball. Oh, up airs. the up air chains. Oh, oh my god, catches the air dodge onto the platform too, and Nizumama has 74% oh, in the back air. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I think the stage peg is like coming back to bite him because uh, he had like nowhere to go. He was just chasing those air dodges, man. Yeah, as long as like Ryu <laughs> has grounds to work with, he can just catch you slipping and damn, he's already on his last stock. This is actually crazy. It, it is a very volatile stage. It's like high risk, high reward. Yeah. And then it's not really working out in his favor right now. Definitely. And oh, oh my god, he's just going in with these aggressive uppers, but nice can be able to witch time that one and get that down smash, I mean up smash off. And uh, here's Mama taking that first stock. Let's see what he can do. But if he could like, if he could like high key cheese him here, I could see it, bro. I can see the comeback. Oh, nice. I'll just hop to air dodge yeah. back, back in though. Playing it safe. Oh, he wants his back air, bro. Dude, that F tilt back air confirm is like so underratedly good. Yeah. It'd be killing so early, bro. It's crazy. Ashima, of course, well aware of that. Fishing for it right now, but oh, nice. Best was in that jab. Trying to get back onto the stage again, but Ashima, this ledge pressure is oh. so scary. The ABK gets punished again on a shield. Oh, looking for that parry for that uh, get up attack timing, but is Mama luckily gonna be able to get that timing right in? Oh, oh damn! All right, that was a that was a quick one. God damn! 
Well, props, props for uh, Usher on that 3-0. Yeah, that was, that was quick. <laughs> that was pretty convincing. Yeah, that was very dominant. I, I actually thought was that was going to be like a lot closer. I'm not going to yeah. lie. Damn. I'm sure they've like played before, I'd assume, at least once. But mm -hmm. I'm not the expert, actually. <laughs> I, I got no idea if they did. I don't have my, I don't have my uh, PG stats on me, unfortunately. Also, I wonder who's playing over there, because there's a giant crowd. If you can see that behind, there's like a camcorder and everything. Oh my god. It's probably Zachary. I'd assume. <laughs> if it's anybody, it's probably Zachary, yeah. Zachary, Joey Boo, who yeah. else? Excuse <laughs> me. Oh, Toriguri. <laughs> those, those, those three, right? True, Toriguri's got a fan base. But I'd assume they're on stream, though. Like, they gotta be on stream, right? Not it's probably always. Gonna be, like, not always, but like... Because, like, Zachary just makes makes it all the way through. That's so, true. Like, he's there's no like, need yeah, to put it in top, yeah. eh? Well, you know. <laughs> he's fine. We'll see him on the stream regardless. But up next, I think we got Gag Raki? I assume? Uh, I think so. Yeah, probably. I want to see how um, the Dory Miki match is going. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's true, yeah. I mean, it's still going, so I don't think it's a clean 3-0, <laughs> at least. Oh, I, I do see it. Oh! Just heard a pop-off somewhere. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, no, it's, uh, yeah, getting to Gag Rocky. Uh, introduced him earlier before, but in case you're just tuning in, Rocky, uh, probably more of an unfamiliar face for Western people watching this tournament, mm -hmm. and he's a Steve Kazia Minmin player. I think he might have a Rob, too. <laughs> I, I don't know. So, like, uh, you know. He, he plays oh, all the online characters. It, yeah. He, he, you know, he's in it to win it, bro. He's yeah. in it to win it. And uh, win it, he does, because he's been doing extremely well recently. Of course, getting to winner side of uh, this Kagari Bikulon. So, enough of a statement in itself. And uh, I don't think he upset anything 